What's up everyone? This car right here, this is an 08 335XI, was having a 30FF code. Every time you floored it, it was only boosting four pounds when it should have been boosting eight to nine from the factory. Now, this car here specifically has brand new turbos, brand new vacuum canisters, brand new vacuum lines, uh, you name it and it has it. I didn't do the work, some other mechanic did that. I'm just here trying to fix the 30FF code. If you are having a 30FF code and you're in a similar situation, trace your vacuum lines, okay? And make sure none of them are pinched. In this car, we actually found a pinched line right over here. So this line going down to the turbo, let me put this light a little less bright. That line going down to the turbo was pinched uh, against that metal bracket right there. You can see how it's going down. That metal bracket was all the way pinched uh, on the line and that was actually causing that 30FF code. Literally all I did was, sorry, take a little pry bar, I put it in between there, I just pulled it, I just pried it out. Oh, let me try this with the uh, flashlight. Mm-hmm. Good, how's that? And 30 FF was fixed. We took this car and it was a nine day difference. It pulled really strong. It was boosting eight, nine PSI. We are now gonna install the JB4 on here, but I don't wanna put the JB4 on before fixing a 30 FF code. It's not, it's not a good thing to do. So just wanted to put that out there. If you're having 30 FF code, follow your vacuum lines, make sure that they're not pinched, make sure they're not kinked, make sure they're not ripped anywhere. Uh, and yeah, besides that, go from there. If your turbos are not, uh, if they're not, have, if they haven't been replaced and you still have this 30 FF code, it could be just bad waste kits or bad turbos. I've had another car where it was throwing a 30 FF code, but the turbos were actually bad. Uh, but yeah, there's other things you can check. You could check these canisters. You could bypass them just to check them to see if they're good or bad and your vacuum lines and then these two boost solenoids over there. So thanks for watching. If there's any other comments or concerns, uh, leave them below and I will get to you. Peace.